on everybody it is another lovely lovely wonderful day i hope everybody's having an amazing day and i hope your night is gonna be just as amazing today i am making nice warm gooey mac and cheese homemade mac and cheese from scratch y'all it's gonna be good it's gonna be short it's gonna be sweet it's gonna be delicious all right everybody before we start please don't forget to like and subscribe click the bell icon to be notified whenever i upload videos i do four videos every week all right let's get to the ingredients off with the cheddar cheese got the mozzarella cheese we got the Monterey Jack cheese, Parmesan cheese. I got me some flour. Got me my elbow macaroni. Got my milk, salt, and my oil. And that's all we're gonna need for right now. All right, let's get started. All right guys, so what I did was I had my water boiling and I add a little bit of salt a little bit of um, oil and then I add my pasta all right everybody I got my pot for my sauce and what I'm what I did was I add some oil to it and now I'm just gonna add a little bit of flour to make a nice roux just to thicken it up some this is going to be the beginning of a creamy rich four cheese sauce right. so I'm gonna whisk this for maybe about mm, maybe about three minutes I'm, I'm trying you have to cook the roux so um you don't have that starchy uh, you ever eat something and you can taste the starch in the background so you want to make sure that your roux is cooked so you don't taste that starch, that background starch. Oh, and one thing I'm gonna tell you too about the pasta is, you do not wanna cook this pasta completely. Make it a little bit below al dente because you're gonna go ahead and bake it afterwards. So you don't want it to overcook. You want it to have that nice al dente uh, texture to it when you're finished. So I would recommend you cook the pasta for maybe about seven, maybe mm, five to seven minutes. And then um, if the sauce isn't done within five minutes, which I doubt, you want to drain it and add your ice to it. So you can add your ice water to it so it, you can stop the cooking process. Because you ever have some mac and cheese sometimes and it tastes so mushy and the, the, the pasta is, uh -uh, I don't like that at all. Okay, so now we have our roux. I'm gonna go ahead just come with my milk half and half could work with this too give me one second okay and I'm just gonna leave this I'm gonna continue stirring until it starts to boil stir it make sure you whisk it so all the lumps of the roux is out put it on low heat continue stirring um i would stir it maybe i would check it every, maybe every two minutes just to make sure that it doesn't scorch because it's not gonna taste good if you get this to scorch if you taste that burnt flavor at the end of it it's not gonna be good unless you like burnt but I don't okay so yep I'll be back okay so my sauce is getting thicker if you look at it you will see it's getting nice and thick what I'm going to do now is I'm going to start adding my cheese Louise I'm gonna start off with some mozzarella and I'm leaving a little bit so I can add to the top. I'm gonna add my mozzarella cheese. 
I'm gonna come back, add my Parmesan. Add my Monterey Jack. And my cheddar. Cheddar is better. Cheddar, cheddar. Into this, I'm just gonna stir everybody. Stir it up. Oh, yes. Lika darling, stir it up. Come on, baby. Stir it up now. Little darling, stir it up. Ooh. Look at that. Look at the goo. Look at the goo, y'all. You know, ramp it in I mean, it's not a ramping thing. Look at that. I'm just going to continue to stir. And if it gets a little bit too thick, I'll add some more milk. But for now, I'm just waiting for the cheese to melt. Before I determine whether I want to add any more cheese. Okay, my sauce is now I'm going to add just a little bit of salt, not too much because the cheese is already salty. So and I, I have a very very low tolerance for salt. I can't do a lot of salt, y'all. If the food is too salty, I can't eat it. There's no going around it. I just I can't. Okay, and all that go with cheese. Gonna loosen it up with a little, with a little bit more milk. Nice. Alaska's part of the states, right? Melty, huh? Alaska's part of the states, right? Part of the states. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, y'all, so my cheese sauce is done. Okay, guys, so I have my pasta. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add my cheese sauce. Look at that. Oh, to my pasta. I'm going to mix this. Make it nice. We're not coming for four, so we're not coming for fight. I have my casserole bowl, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to spray it with my nonstick spray. Then I'm going to go ahead pour my mac and cheese mixture. Oh, look at that! Oh, baby. see that then I'm gonna top it off with the rest of the mozzarella cheese y'all seeing this look good enough okay top it off with the rest of the mozzarella cheese Ooh. 
then I'm gonna come again top it off some more with my cheddar cheese my cheddar my cheddar is better than your cheddar okay did I see that and then I'm going to pop it in the oven and let this get nice and warm and bubbly mm-hmm all right everybody and look at the end result of my mac and cheese homemade mac and cheese I'm gonna go ahead and take a little part out so you can see that oh baby Woo. look at that oh guys look look how nice and creamy that is oh my goodness look how me mess up the presentation though god Chow. traditional mac and cheese y'all made from scratch and get okay everybody and there you have it my homemade mac and cheese made from scratch this is warm this is gooey this is nice four cheeses oh my lord oh ooh, ooh. Ooh. my baby gonna love this all right everybody thank you so 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 much for joining in making my lovely mac and cheese four cheeses they say i know one i know two i know three me say a four, 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 four cheese. Say and a one, and a two, and a three. A four, 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 four cheese. Hey! <laughs> okay, enough of me and my shenanigans. All right, everybody, thank you so, 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 so much for joining in. I hope you guys like it. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you learned something today. And I want you guys to have a wonderful, wonderful day. Please, guys, before we leave, don't forget to like and subscribe. Click the bell icon so you can get notified whenever I upload a video. I do four videos every single week. Thank you so, 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 so much, guys. And I hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye.